Well, hello, my friendly shoppers, and welcome back. This is Gina, and this is my shopping life. I hope your day is going great so far. We are back shopping at Trader Joe's, and spring is officially here. Look at these gorgeous flowers and the options. Now, they don't have all the pricing out, so I'm not going to be able to tell you all the pricing. You can see some of it here, but they're all so pretty. I mean, look how pretty these are. I just, I love the little planters. I mean, how cute. These little succulents, they are like babies. That is so adorable. The spray roses are so pretty. Now, a lady was out. She did tell me that these were $11.99. And this is the first time that Trader Joe's has had these. How cute are these baskets with the succulents? I am like overwhelmed that this is just so adorable. I love this so much. What a great idea. Trader Joe's needs to get more items like these because they are so cute. It's so original. I mean, where else are you going to find those? Now, the hydrangeas, I have to grab one. I mean, this red one, look how gorgeous. I did get a purple one. I bought a couple at Costco and I just love these flowers. They're so pretty and they just make my day. And honestly, this is probably one of my favorite parts at Trader Joe's is just seeing all the beautiful floral arrangements. And I just love this little area. Now the strawberries, the freeze dry strawberries, these are actually really good for drinks. I've tried them out. They're $2.99 and I like those. The breadcrumbs. Now, the organic breadcrumbs and the panko breadcrumbs, those are such good prices. I always get them here at Trader Joe's. But this is new for $4.99, the Celebration Cake and Baking Mix. I like the packaging. It kind of has a 70s vibe to it. And you're getting the cake mix, the frosting, and the sprinkles. You could do cupcakes or the cake. And this is actually really, really cool, especially for $5. The blueberry muffin mix for $4.50. The banana bread mix for $2.99. And I do like their mixes because they're very easy and they're actually quite good. Now, even this one, the blondie bar. Yeah, that was a good one as well. And the brownies. Of course, I love brownies. Now, the tissue box, 99 cents. I like this. If you need one, you just buy one. And they're actually good tissues. I always like the little sayings on here. And they are there for you. But I like these. I usually buy them in bulk at another store. But if I need just one, yeah, Trader Joe's, definitely the place. All-purpose disinfectant cleaner. This is new here. $3.99 fresh citrus. And you do want to read some of the caution on there. Scented candle trio. I like that they've switched from silver to the copper. This is actually really pretty. Raspberry and roses, rhubarb and bamboo. And then we have lemon verbena. Ooh, those sound so good. And I like that they have samples so you can smell them. $10 for the set. Now I've always seen the lavender soap for $2.99. I haven't seen the citrus one. I don't, is that new or have I just not paid attention? Probably most likely I haven't paid attention. <laughs> the unscented deodorant is back. That's such a good value and it works well. The hand sanitizer spray. I like these. I think they smell really good. And if your throat's a little dry, especially from allergies, that happens with me. These supplement drops and the cough drops, they work really well. They're a great price for $1.50. Okay, we have a new ice cream. And that's just the bad news. Let's look at the good news. Look at this flavor, Dulce de Leche ice cream. Yum. I'm definitely going to pick that up. I think Trader Joe's really knocks it out of the park when it comes to their ice creams. They're the best. Ooh, the Portuguese custard tarts. Now these are good. And you're getting four of them in here. You just heat them up. Of course, I do like custard desserts. And for that package, $2.99. They always have some good ones. The chocolate lava cakes, those are really good. $3.79. Now the cookies and cream, the pretzel slims are back. And those are $3.50. And what else can we find? Oh, so during spring break, I always like to make like spinach dip. This is the organic chopped spinach, or you could get the regular chopped spinach. It's really up to you, but there's so many great little recipes. And I don't always see the spinach here at Trader Joe's, 
but I like this because you know you can freeze it so you can have it for some time. And here are the prices. The organic is about two dollars and thirty cents and the regular is a dollar eighty. Now this is new. Ooh, the croissant swirls, okay, with chocolate chips. Well, we are going to try these out. So yes, we are going to try some food at the end. Those are $3.99. Now, this is one of my favorite quiche, the mixed mushroom and spinach quiche. And that one is $2.99. But this one, the broccoli and cheddar quiche, I don't remember seeing this one. So I'm gonna pick that one up and try that one out. That sounds good. And I am a huge fan of quiche, so I always love quiche. <gasps> Oh, these are back and I just dropped everything. I got so excited. Okay, Dorothy's Guarded Secrets. Okay, this cheese is so good. It is just so good. Trust me, it is really good. I'm actually going to grab two. I only see these like once a year. They are $7.99 each, but absolutely worth it. Oh, I still haven't tried this one. Now this is the baked lemon ricotta cheese. It sounds really good. Perfect for spring and summer. It's $13.99. That is per pound. And so you kind of want to look at the package. And $8.11 for that one. Oh, these are pretty. Now, I really am not a beer drinker, but if you've tried these, I think the packaging is really pretty. And it's an L with Syrah grapes. Huh. This is super adorable. Like I said, I just think the packaging is really pretty. And this one. Oh, okay. Now this one is really interesting. I'm going to zoom in on here because it has Thai basil and lemongrass. Oh, wow. I almost have to try these. I'm not going to today, but almost <laughs> $12.99 if you have and of course any of the items please share us your feedback in the comments below the chocolate mousse eggs only this time of year those are so good those are $3.99 or they have the raspberry mousse cakes now these are really good as well at $3.99 they're the perfect little bites oh and we have a new insulated bag well I have to pick it up it's purple and I love purple I have the yellow one, but I'm definitely going to grab another one. And these actually insulate really well. Oh, how pretty. And everybody gets so excited over the Trader Joe bags. I know. They're $7.99 as well. This is my little mini haul right here. And so we are going to go home and we're going to try a few of these. All right. We have, again, the croissants. I don't know if I'm going to do the lava cakes. There's a couple of different sweets here, but let's try these foods out. And I am very excited and I'm hungry, so <laughs> I'm ready. Okay, of course, I got to try this one first. And I have to be really careful because I'll eat the whole thing. And it's easy because Trader Joe's, their ice creams are always so good. They do such a great job with it. And here we go. I'm going to dip it right in. Okay, I need two hands. <laughs> I know the deeper I go, the more I'm going to get. And oh my, yeah, they did it again. This is so good. And of course, you know, caramel with ice cream, it's, it's always works. Now, the croissant swirls chocolate chip. These look super cute. Now, the nutrition facts, it's not printed right but that's okay. I'm just gonna cook up about three of these and you do wanna cook them in your oven. So let's try this out. This is just a perfect little package. I mean, look at how tiny they are. All right, we're gonna bake these up. And here we go. Oh, they smell good. I just think these are so adorable. If you're serving brunch and you know, you're putting together like a little board and a bunch of different things, uh, these are perfect. They're just the right amount. And I really do like those, especially if you want just one. And you know, you could cook as many or as little as you want. If you want to just bake one, you could definitely do that, but that works. All right, the broccoli and cheddar quiche. 
or cheddar cheese quiche, <laughs> 420 calories. But we're gonna bake this in the oven right here. You can cook it in the microwave if you want to. And so here is the microwave package. You definitely wanna take the plastic wrap off, but you could cook it in that tray in the microwave, but I'm gonna bake it in the oven. And here we go. All right, I always like with the the item looks just like it does like on the package. And so I'm gonna cut this up in fours and share it. And it smells good. You can see the broccoli, you can see the cheese. And the taste of it, it actually tasted really good. It was a little salty. That's just for me. I don't know if, again, if you've tried it, let me know what you think of it, but it was really good. I would get it again, honestly. Now the cheese. Oh, I am so excited about this one because it is just so good. You have basil, you have oregano, you have sage. And here is the back of it. I wish they carried this more often, but the last time I saw this was like last May. And of course my pita bite crackers, those are my favorite. <laughs> so let's open this up. See, it's a pretty flower. So if you're putting together like a charcuterie board, that would work. Here's the inside of it. And so I'm just gonna eat a quarter at a time but look how good I do cut off the outside and this is just so good I definitely recommend this cheese if you haven't tried it I know it's a little bit on the higher price but yeah it is absolutely worth it everyone well thank you so much for coming along to Trader Joe's with me today thank you again for your time and for watching take care and I will talk to you later